Hey guys, welcome back to Mind Pump TV. I'm your host, Serene Wilkin. In this video, we're gonna go through a full body workout. Now, this is only for exercises. It shouldn't take you more than 15 to 20 minutes, and it's very, very effective. So let's get started. All right, you guys, we're gonna start your full body workout with leg exercises. I've got a kettlebell in front of me. We're gonna go right into a sumo deadlift. So for sumo stance, you can go extra wide. You can go about medium width. For me, this feels good. You're gonna go ahead and grab the bell in front of you, root through your feet, proud chest, come up. As you guys come down, stick your butt behind you, feel the stretch in your hamstrings, your glutes, and then push right back up. Inhale and exhale. Just keeping that bell nice and centered. You're feeling your inner thighs, your glutes, your hamstrings, and your quads. All right, you guys. Next up, we're going to do stationary lunges. I've got weights in my hands. I'm starting at the bottom. And this way, you're just going to recruit everything in a nice clean plane going upwards. We're going to push and inhale back. Touch down, exhale, push. And this also helps you guys find your alignment in the beginning of the exercise so you're not kind of fixing it during the exercise. Exhale, push, inhale back. You wanna feel the front leg as well as the back leg working, not just the front leg. A nice open chest and upright. All right, you guys, next is incline chest press. Go ahead and find yourself on a bench like this. We're gonna grab our weights, come close to our body, roll our body back, and then from there, find an arc in our back. So just a natural arc. Elbows come out to the side, 90 degree, and begin to push on your exhale. <sighs> Making sure my shoulder blades are connected with the bench. As I bend, I keep that nice 90 degree. Everyone's gonna be a little bit different when creating that shape, depending on their shoulder mobility. <sighs> Inhale down, exhale press. You wanna look straight up towards the ceiling as you perform this exercise, focusing on the upper part of our chest as well as the front of our delt. Inhale and exhale. Think about where you're pressing. I like to think about my knuckles facing the ceiling and having a nice steady grip on each weight. All right, you guys, next is our inclined supinated row. I'm face down on the bench here. I've got my supinated grip with my weights. I want you guys to try to connect your core, tuck your tail slightly here, and then from there, pull your shoulder blades back. We're gonna go ahead and pull the weights upwards. So notice, you wanna find middle of your back, your lats, your traps, and also your biceps. Exhale, pull, <sighs> inhale back. Really pulling the shoulder blades in and together as you guys pull the weights. <sighs> now commonly what people will do, they'll kind of swing the weights back or have a lot of movement in the bottom part of the arm. Focus on where your elbow is going, right by the side of your body and inhale. <sighs> Just keeping a nice slow and controlled movement. You're hitting a lot of different points in your back as well as your biceps. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed that full body workout. Remember, that's four exercises. Three sets of each is desired. You wanna go eight to 12 reps, and those are straight sets. So finish one exercise and then move on to the next. And that will get you guys going into building more muscle. If you're also looking to build muscle and burn fat, check out our free guides at mindpumpfree.com. And if you like this video, comment, subscribe below, and we'll see you soon.